Good day friends, my name is Joe Poke, and welcome back to Space Engine. So I wasn't sure if I was going to make any more of these, or when I was going to um, continue the series, if I ever did. Um, but a couple days ago, a new update was released, and it's the .98 update. And um, this has been a long time coming. I don't know if uh, there's anything really that new, um, because I think a lot of the stuff that was added is bouncing off of uh, the 0974, which is like an alpha, beta alpha beta which was like a beta test of the the beta release the, the next update release you, you know what i mean so I, i'm not sure how much there is actually new in this but i have the list of things that they added over here um which is cool i'm actually planning uh this time it's crazy so one thing that i think we might do um i'm not sure how it'll work because i never messed around with it i've never even felt compelled to mess with the spaceship mechanics of this game um but maybe we can check it out uh, this time. So, I don't really know where to begin here. Um, okay, so, wait, I guess we have to build it then? It's basic. Let's start, let's go basic. Because that's, oh, oh, look at that. We have a spaceship now. That was easy. Haha. Uh, take control. Whoa. I'm already kind of starting to regret this. What do all these things do? Supposedly they added a whole bunch of new, um, like, controls and stuff like that for the spaceships in this game. I'm not sure that there's really a functional purpose to using the spaceships other than to have a, a different kind of experience when playing it. Um, but... Let's, let's go, um, let's warp. How do you turn the spaceship around? It's a really cool spaceship. Look at that. Um, I'm not sure if they changed anything else major, um, if, they have, if there was any other major changes with this update, but supposedly, let's see what we have here. So for the planets, which is really the most important thing to me, because um, I just like to look at the planets, they said there's new volcanoes, cyclones on terrestrial planets, um, cyclones and textures on gas giants, so cool. Oh, there's they added detail-less gas giants, like, um, like Uranus and uh, Neptune and stuff like that. Aha! See? I was right. I knew they, they... It says suppressed mountain generation in impact basins. I don't know what that means, but... I to, I knew that there was something weird, because it was a lot less mountains the last time I, I played this. Um, I don't know what's going on with the spaceship here. Oh, we're moving. Yeah, let's go. Let's do that. How do I... How do I go back to... Oh, there we go. I have to right-click. So... I, I guess you can warp. Let's try warping. Target... Select target, um, that star. Oh, cool. All right, um, how do we go? Can we go? All right, I, I really don't know how to control the spaceship. I, you can like kind of click and drag to turn it around, but, uh, no, no, what are you doing? It's very weird to control. I'm trying to see if I can line up on this warp thing. Maybe that's how you warp. I'm really, I'm honestly, I've never done this before. All right, it's freaking out. You know what? Let's not mess with spaceships right now. Maybe we'll come back to it later. All right, so as with every Space Engine video, now is about the time where we should talk about No Man's Sky. I am very excited. Um, so in about five days, I think, when I'm recording this, uh, five, four, four days, ooh, four days. Um, four days from recording this video, uh, Space Engine, um, Space Engine, No Man's Sky is coming out, and um, I hope See, the thing is, I've been hearing a lot of stuff lately and about the creator, and he doesn't want um, spoilers to come out about the game, but I guess that's, he can't really control that when the game's out, because a lot of people are going to be posting videos. Because I, I don't want to feel guilty um, posting, like, a, a series about uh, playing the game, because I really want to do that, because I think it'll be a lot of fun for the channel. Um, but I, I don't want to, like, disrespect Sean Murray, who created the game. Um... But yeah, so I'm probably still going to do uh, videos as soon as I possibly can. As soon as I can preload No Man's Sky, I will be putting out uh, lo loads of videos uh, about it. I'm trying to find a planet that might have those cyclones or... I keep hitting escape. I don't know why I keep doing that. Um, but I'm trying to find a planet with those... Um, what did it say? Cyclones? Cyclones, yeah. That sounds really cool. I don't know how they work or look. Supposedly they added kind of... Um, where is it? Uh, alien vegetation on titans with terrestrial life. I don't know if that's like just a little bit of green that you see on some planets, 
but maybe it, maybe it looks cool. Who knows? We'll try to find that too. Whoa. This gas giant looks like a painting. Doesn't it? Doesn't it kind of look like Starry Night? Just with the way the, uh... That's really neat looking. I like that. I might take a screenshot. I don't usually look at gas giants, but this one kind of caught my eye. Up in here. It looks really nice. I like the blue and the white. It's very cool looking. Neat. Whoa. Look at these rings on this guy. Ooh, cool. You don't really see, like, uh, black rings. Maybe it's just because... Oh, I guess it's because um, it's, like, perfectly in line with the sun, so they're not really lit, maybe? I don't know. That's really weird. Yeah, I guess that is it, because look at the shadow line. The shadow... There's, like, no... Like, the shadow from the rings is, like, just a straight line. Maybe. Maybe they're just dark. That's really weird. I want to try to get, like, a good look at them. But it's hard because they're so dark. I guess this is that, that other thing that they supposedly added. It says in here that they added, like, rings that are really light, like, um, like Jupiter's rings. So, maybe that's what this is. They are certainly dark. You can see them moving. Yeah, like, they are. It's kind of weird to look at because you don't really see them over here, but you see them when it's on here. It looks like I'm looking through, like, a lens. Huh. Interesting. What is up with this planet? What? Where's the star? Oh! That is weird! Look how dark this is! That's a crazy eclipse. This is actually really cool. I wanna, like, get out of here. It's super dim for me because I have my screen brightness really low, so it doesn't, like, shine in my face when I'm recording, but... Wow, that is strange. This is the only part of the planet that's illuminated. Look at that! You can see the... Oh my god, that's really neat. This is actually one of the coolest things I've ever seen in this. Just this little bit of light. I'm gonna go to the edge over here. Look, a volcano. They added new volcanoes. I don't know if this is one of them. I don't know what they mean by new volcanoes, but... Oh, wait, where'd the, where'd the light spot go? Oh, no. I'm gonna miss the eclipse. I wanna watch the eclipse. Let's stay here and watch this happen. Um, let's move forward a little bit. Maybe it's a bug, because it looks like we're still in the light. Oh, it's going down. Speed up time just a little bit. Look at that. There it goes. Here's the eclipse. How do I get out of here? Go away. Oh, I don't know how to get rid of that. There we go. I kind of just want to watch this happen. Speed up time just a little bit more. Is this the, is this the Aurora? Yeah, wait. And this is the Aurora coming in. Are we are we near a pole? That's really interesting. There's the Aurora. As the eclipse is coming, you can see it moving around. This is really neat. I've never seen such a strong eclipse where the planet is completely in the dark. I guess that's what happens to the moon, though, right? Huh. Oh. Oh, there it goes. Wow. <laughs> that is really cool. Now let's see if we can zoom out. Yeah, look, we were right at the pole. Look, completely black. That is crazy. That was neat. I think it was even cooler just to see that little speck of light. Where's that other planet, though? There it is. Okay, so now I kind of want to fast forward time. Let's look at it from this angle. Let's fast forward time until the eclipse goes away. Oh, wait, that was too quick. Let's go backwards. Let's see it come out. Whoa. Neat. That's really cool. 
Eclipses is such a simple, like an eclipse is such a simple concept, but it, it looks really cool. That's cool. That's a good, a good thing to have in this video. I, we haven't seen any any clips like that in, the, in a video. Cool. All right. What should we do next? Whoa! Again with these gas giants. Like this one looks really cool too. It's interesting. Like I, I, I don't. Maybe they've always looked like this, but they look almost. I'm not sure. I don't think it's less realistic, but they look more like artistic. I really like that. This design. I, I'm really digging this one. I like the colors. Alright, let's find one last thing to do. Um, I want to find something that's on this list of stuff. Maybe this is what the cyclone is. That's not like... Maybe the cyclone was what I was mistaking for a hurricane. Hmm. I don't, I don't know. Maybe maybe that's what it was. And I'm making it look way cooler than it actually will. <laughs> but, um... I don't know. This is a cool little titan. It doesn't have any life or anything on it, but... I like the colors are interesting. Like, we have, like this really light color over here then it gets sort of orangey let's go underneath this hurricane cyclone whatever it might be whoa that's an interesting color scheme oh look at that it's like got some green in there too cool all right one awesome screenshot for the thumbnail and then i'm calling this a video and i'm really liking the way this one turned out i hope you guys enjoy it I know a lot of you um, really like the space engine stuff, and you know it's space engine's awesome. What can I say? about that for a thumbnail. I have my space engine over here, you know, and we have this on, I like this colors, they're just like a like greenish yellow hint, and I like this little cluster we have over here, very artsy, I like it a lot. Alright, thank you guys so much um, for continuing to watch my channel, we've actually had a really sharp increase in views lately, I have no idea why, I guess it's just because it's the summer and more people have time to watch videos like when, when school's out and all that stuff so yeah um hopefully you guys are looking forward to no man's sky and i really look forward to recording videos of it and yeah, that is about it so thank you guys so much for watching this video if you enjoyed please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more and as always i will see you guys in the next video goodbye